Okay, so I'm having a little browse through the owner's manual and I've come across something which is, well, it's really worrying me. Here is the fuel gauge and there is the low fuel warning light. But here's the problem. It's only available on some models. Now, because my car is a buttery biscuit base with plastic trims, no fog lights, um, manual windows, that some models does not include my model. I'm 99.9% .9 sure. In fact, let's face it, I'm 100% sure because it hasn't come on the warning light at all. And it turns out the reason it hasn't come on is because I haven't got one. Oh dear. I'm going to have to be very, very careful when that needle drops below E for empty. No, it's definitely gone. Yeah, it's gone. Rather embarrassing, I think I ran out of petrol. The first time it's ever happened to me driving, I've been driving for almost exactly seven years, I've never run out of petrol before. Um, Odd though, because I mean, I put like, quite a lot in it yesterday, well, 20 quid's worth, about nine and a half litres, and it's only got me 76 kilometres, so that is odd. I've got a petrol station literally just over there, so I'm going to, I suppose I'm going to have to buy a jerry can, fill it with petrol and bring it over here. I can't even limp over there, which is really bloody annoying. Hmm. It's a bit embarrassing, I've run out of petrol. Yeah. Literally just over there, and um, yeah, just that. This is the motorist's equivalent of the walk of shame. Okay, so the roadside refueling is complete. I felt like a prize mug standing there refueling my car. Very embarrassing. Um, but uh, of course, there's no guarantee that it was a petrol issue. So uh, let's start her up. Yeah, no, I'm I fine. Can't even cross the petrol. Yeah, I'm. Oh, listen, I appreciate that. I'm not even sure if it is petrol or not. I put probably about a tenner in there, and it's. Uh, you, is it? Would it be overheating or anything? I doubt it, because my temperature gauge looks okay. I only got it, and it's it's low. I know it's old, but it's I low know, mileage, know, but yeah, you know. I know. Um, I'll keep trying. Where are you, if you I don't mind me? I'm literally that pink house. So you need anything on, or just to sit down and take a break and come back to if you want. That. All right. Sam, thanks very much. Thank you. Maybe I haven't put enough in. I'll try and put more in, I think. Yeah. Right, I've emptied that jerry can pretty much into the petrol tank. I put about half in before thinking I could store a bit in the car. But, uh, let's see. get the feel through the system. Is that going to work? I think it has done. It has done. So it was fuel then. Ah, oh, thank God for that. I thought I was going to be faced with a lengthy bill for repairs. And this wouldn't be a good, it's never a good time, but just now wouldn't be a good time for it. Um, but now I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. And that very, very kind lady. Um, was, was really, really kind, wasn't she? Just that, sorry, me not having gear there. Yeah, that uh, was obviously my issue then. No, no fuel, and then too low a fuel when I put the spare fuel in. Ah, the master lives to fight another day, and not thanks to my stupidity. <laughs> 